Hey, it's Brandon. So I'm going to show you how to add a user to your Google My Business listing. Uh, first thing you need to do is make sure that you are logged in to the browser for the account that's set up under your Google My Business. Um, a lot of uh, people have uh, different accounts, one for personal use, one for their business use. So just make sure that you are logged in under the correct one that you had set up your Google My Business listing for. Um, then you're going to click on Google Apps right here and then you click my business. Uh, keep in mind that this may be in a certain a different area in here. Um, if, if you hold down the mouse, you can actually move these around. Um, so, you know, you might have to scroll down. It might be somewhere else. Um, if you did, this is not displayed, then that's a, a good indicator that you're logged into the incorrect email for the Google My Business. So uh, anyway, we're gonna go ahead and click on that. Now, if you have multiple accounts or locations, um, this will take you to a little bit different screen, but it'll actually list out all the different locations. So you'll just have to click on the one that you want to add the user to. Uh, you will have to do this for each one. If, if let's say, um, you want to add the same user to three different locations, uh, but it's real easy to do. So uh, if you just have one location, no problem. It'll take you right to this page. Um, and from here on out, it'll look the same. Um, so on the left-hand menu over here, we're just going to scroll down to users, click on that. It's going to pull up this page. We're going to go ahead and click add users. And then you will go ahead and enter in the email address the person gave you to be added on. Um, this oftentimes is a, a different email than uh, the, you know, the person's regular email, but just make sure that the, you have the correct email address to enter in here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and choose role. Nine times out of 10, you're going to go ahead and choose manager. There's no reason to add somebody as an owner unless they actually own it, the business. Um, and site manager, we don't really use that. So manager's great. They can do everything on your Google and business page as far as editing and optimizing. Um, it pretty much except for adding other users or deleting the page and you know, stuff like that. So we go ahead and click manager, enter that in, and then you're going to click invite. And that's it. They'll get an email and asking them that they've been added on and for them to accept it. Um, they do have to click the button to accept it. So make sure you let them know you sent it. Uh, sometimes it, it can end up in your spam or junk folder, but they will have to click a button to accept it. And then um, they will then show up in here. Um, and then if you want to delete them, there should be like a little trash can or X icon that you can just click if you don't want them to have access anymore. Uh, and that's it. So let me know if you have any questions and I'll be happy to help. Thanks.